Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to yet another Comment Smackdown video, where we take a look at the comment section for the latest trailer and try to gauge what the feeling of the internet is. And we all know, every time there's a Marvel trailer, the reaction is pretty much the same. I feel, I feel like a lightning bolt hit the tip of my penis. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's just about it. I mean, is it wrong that I kind of want to see one Marvel movie that comes out which is just an absolute train wreck, just a complete train wreck, total disaster, just to see how the fans would react? Is it wrong for me to, to wish for that? I don't know, but part of me would just love to see that. Because when everything's so awesome all the time, it just kind of gets a bit crap. I just want to see Marvel fail, just once, just once. Well, I mean, I guess we kinda sorta got that, but I'm talking about like an actual real dumpster fire of a movie. But this is not going to be that. Let's take a look at the covert section. I hope they remember you. This is quickly becoming one of the most memorable quotes ever spoken. Well, apart from all these other Marvel quotes that the commenters are happy to bring in. I am Iron Man. I could do this all day. I'm always angry. I am Groot. I never freeze. I'm Star-Lord. I'm kind of a slut, you know, back when I was with Hawkeye and then I was with Captain America and then I was Hulk, you know, I, I kind of get around. I don't know if you guys remember that catchphrase from Black Widow, but uh, you know, I think I kind of do. Serious, no joke. I met Chris Evans yesterday and I asked him where the Soul Stone was and he said, Aunt May has it. And he gave me that cheeky smile. Aww. <laughs> Chris Evans, he's such a sweetie pie. Thanos, I've come to bargain. Romamu, 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 I've come to bargain. I've come to bargain. Romamu, Romamu, Romamu. And your assault on my world. Never come back. Do it, and I'll break the loop. You know, it's true, Doctor Strange did sort of trap whatever that last monster thing was in his movie, in that infinite time loop. He could probably do the same thing to Thanos, except doesn't does Thanos already have the time gem, or is it in the, the time turner thing that he has? I'm not too sure, but, but I'm sure they'll come up with some convenient excuse to allow Thanos not to be affected by that. My goosebumps have goosebumps, and the children of my goosebumps too. Goosebumpsception. Honestly, I think this trailer made more money than the Justice League. Damn! Ooh, yeah, you know what? I noticed in this comment section, DC is just now the sad whipping boy of Marvel. God, that sucks. What did you do, Warner Brothers? Like, why did you leave Zack Snyder in control of the DC Universe for so long? After Man of Steel, should have got rid of him right away, but it took multiple other movies for you to learn that lesson, and now Justice League is just a joke. Justice League. Justice League is a joke. Well done, Warner Brothers. It takes real talent to squander that much potential. I think Cap will remove the gauntlets from Thanos' hand. Think so. Uh, I suppose he could, but then Thanos would just splat him with the other hand. Marvel is just marvellous. You know, that pun is so obvious, it's staggering that no one's ever made it before. So Avengers Infinity Wars, predictably, everybody loves it. I even got in the comment section and started talking crap about it to, to try to like stir up some butthurtness amongst the Marvel fans, just to have some spiciness in the video, but nobody really took the bait. Just one guy asked me why I was there. I probably should have got in there early, like right after the trailer released, but meh, whatever. Hmm, what's that ominous glow in the distance? 